Hello everyone, I'm Ihsan. In this video, we will see how to change the background of the default keyboard for Samsung smartphone. If previously on the default Samsung keyboard, we couldn't change the background as we prefer. In this video, we will see the latest updates that can make you able to customize the appearance of this default keyboard to be more attractive. You can change various colors of this keyboard from various aspects. It can be from the background and the display of the letters and the symbols of the keyboard. You can change the color of the keyboard theme to blue just like this. You can also change it to red or you can change it to yellow, blue or you can even replace it with your own image. You can change various things from the keyboard like its button, characters, background letters and even from various aspects of the keyboard. You can even change the color of the keyboard on dark mode. So when you activate dark mode on your smartphone, the color of the keyboard will immediately change with the dark mode setting that you have adjusted just like on this video. Ok now let's just take a look on the latest updates on this Samsung smartphone. To change the background color on the default Samsung keyboard, we can take advantage of the latest updates inside the Good Luck application. For those of you who haven't installed Google application, you can check the previous video about how to install it on unsupported region in the link on the previous video. If you have installed the Google application, you can just update the theme park module inside the nice log application. Here you can see the section of theme park module with the words update available. To update this theme park module to the latest one, just click on the three dot icon on the above right corner, then click on open XDA support thread. From here, just scroll a little bit and then click on the Downloader Companion website link. Then here, we just have to look for the newest module, the Theme Park module. Then immediately click on the Theme Park module in this section. Then here, let's scroll and immediately download it. This is the latest version of Samsung Theme Park application. It was just released on October 13th. Here, let's download the application by clicking on this down arrow. Then here, let's scroll and click on See Available APKs button. Then here, click on the Variant Number section. Then scroll down and click on the Download APK button. Then the APK is immediately downloaded in the section down below. Let's wait for a while until the download is complete. Now let's open the application that we've just downloaded. Let's click open at the bottom and let's immediately install the APK by clicking the install button. And the installation process is complete. Now we can immediately open the latest version of Theme Park application. And this is what the Theme Park module looks like on its latest version. With this latest Theme Park update, you can customize the colors, background, and button on your keyboard. For previous version of the Theme Park, it was only possible for theme customization. Now let's click on the keyboard icon here at the bottom center. We will try to create a custom keyboard theme for our Samsung smartphone. Let's click create new at the top left corner. Then click create new at the bottom. And here you can customize the main color of the keyboard. You can choose the main color in this section. We only need to tap and select the color that we want to change. For example, let's choose this color and you can change the color saturation in this section too. Let's click OK and then here in the circle section, you can see what can be customized. You just have to tap on this circle and you can immediately change the color on this section. Below there are also a built-in styles that you can choose right away. You can also use dark themes like this. And there are also several other themes that you can choose down below. If you want to customize much further, you just tap on the circle and change the color like this. Then just tap OK at the bottom. This is the background color of the keyboard that you've just selected. Then here you can also choose another color. If you want the button to be colored, you can first increase the saturation. For transparency, you can also adjust it down below. For example, let's choose this color then click OK. And this is the color of the keyboard keys during typing. Then you can also tap to customize other color. Just increase the saturation and for example, let's select a red color to make it more visible. Then let's click OK at the bottom and this is the red color. This is the color of the letters on the keyboard. Here let's just change it to white and let's change the background to a slightly bluish color. 
Then this is the appearance of the button color when the button is pressed. On this top, this is the pop-up keyboard. For this color, we can choose the color from here. For example, let's choose a darker color. Then next on this button, let's change the background for the keyboard. We can choose the background according to image on your gallery. You can change the background image on your keyboard like this. Or if you don't want to change the image, you can also let it be like this. For the bottom one, to change the color of the letter, you can change it right here. Here we can set it to black, then the last one here is the background color of the letters that haven't pressed. From here you can also set the colors for dark mode. So when you activate dark mode on your smartphone, the color of the theme will immediately change according to the settings that you choose. You just have to tap on the sun icon in the upper right corner, later the theme will immediately change to dark mode. Here you just have to adjust the color as before. Now after you already know all of the settings, then you just need to adjust it according to your own preferences. So after you know all the function in this section, you can immediately customize the theme as you want. You can change many things on the keyboard like background, letters, buttons, and button when pressed, and so on. You just need to adjust it, then after completing the customization of all parts of this keyboard, you can download the theme at the top right corner. To save the keyboard, you can click on this button right here, and here we just need to give it a name for the keyboard theme that we've just created. Then click OK and the theme will be saved immediately. To access the theme, you can go directly to this keyboard section. Then here, just tap on the theme that you've just created. Let's just tap on this section, then click Apply at the bottom. There will be also a preview of the keyboard theme for light mode and dark mode. Just click apply the button and now the theme of your Samsung keyboard will immediately change according to the setup that you've just made. When you press on the keyboard button, a color like this will appear and you can also adjust the background as you want. So even when you use other apps, you can use this theme as well. So now you can change the theme background and also various things for the default Samsung keyboard. So if you use Samsung keyboard, you can now customize the colors easily. If you like videos like this, don't forget to like and subscribe and activate the bell notification button. So you'll be notified when there is a new video from this channel. If you have questions or comments, you can immediately comment on the comment section down below. Or you can also ask directly on our telegram group at this link. You can also ask on our Instagram DM at Sunsertainment. You can find the link on the description of this video. See you in the next video.